What is a uh, Perfect 100 IQ Club? It's Dakar here with yet another banger of a game. This time we're Rengar Jungle into the Karthus. Wow, never seen this matchup before. Also, I missed the level one. I forgot to start recording. That's my... Please forgive me. Oh, whoa. But first, it's time to wake the fuck up and buy some TurboSmurfs.gg. TurboSmurfs.gg. Buy some accounts. That's TurboSmurfs.gg. Code DKR15. Also, runes, items, and skill order displayed on the screen for you, courtesy of deeplol.gg. Use this site, it's the best analytics site on the market. Use it. And without further ado, the gameplay for today. Thanks as always for watching, I appreciate your support, and most importantly, I hope you enjoy the show. I love you, Ranklets. There's a bunch of reasons to path up right here. A, Poppy's OP. B, Alawi can get out of control if you let her. And C, C, Poppy already soloed the Alawi. So she's got no teleport. Everybody wants to be famous. Definitely dead. Oh, the one for one though? Okay, okay. Oh, I got a cover. I just run straight. So get to steal uh raptors as well, but he fucking does. Did he just get it? No, he had gotten that way earlier. Oh, that big guy. I frequently mention this, but the stacks on Relentless Hunter combined with Boots 2 allows for you to be all over the map. Not to mention, I didn't have very much gold, so I don't really have anything else that I can buy. So the boots, too, are obviously the choice. Here's Karthus running around. Notice how active he is despite all of his deaths. That's because of his stupid fucking passive. Zombie passives 100% need a form of nerf. Instead of the death timer starting instantly, it should definitely start after the zombie mode is over. Or, if they want to nerf it in another way, they should make it so they gain, like, less XP or less gold during the zombie. It's just like, give them some kind of detriment. Had a flash. Good stuff, go on. Nobody cares. Blame. See, this one's a little more uh, dangerous to be contesting. Okay, Nautilus didn't come? Sick. I could even get both? One. Two. Sick. Move to top side. So he doesn't get to steal my shit. Ooh, nice. Seven seconds on Cartus. I'm coming. He missed. Pretty nice. Nice, he leveled up too, so he's dead a little longer. 
Very good, very good. It's gonna go to that. What the hell? Ah, he gets the smiter, bro. That's lame. Here comes my boyfriend Poppy to save the day. This guy went straight god mode this game, man. Oh shit. Dude, my phone sat here trying to Google some shit. Did I say anything similar to Google chat? Lame. And tea ladies. So in hindsight, my pathing should have been a little different right there before this whole back. I should have taken the scuttle first, and then I could uh, maybe look at ganking top or whatever, you know? Because I could have contested his blue, and on top of that, kept him from smiting the scuttle for me. He goes dying again. This Paul Walker fella is suicidal as fuck, man. We just go dive. No Carthasaur. Cover this. Do my stacks. This poor, poor LeBlanc, man. And to think all she had to do was walk away half a second sooner. Unfortunately, he got to do the thing because I was sitting there dick dancing with uh, mid. She trusted her own escape way too much right there, man. We ain't escaping that boy. Sitting here running a brush. Yeah, this, this poppy is insane. This guy's insane. So when my ult's down, I generally prioritize farming. And when you're doing that, you need to optimize it in two ways. You need to clear the camps efficiently, and you need to path efficiently. One takes micro, the other takes macro. Practicing the clear mechanics is really easy. You just hop into practice tool and kite the camps, learn your various damage thresholds and number of abilities you gotta use to kill like the baby minions and then the big one and all that. Pathing efficiency is more of a game of memory. Where was Karthus a minute ago? How quick does Karthus clear? Or Sejuani, or Vi, or whoever. Then, based on that information, you can determine maybe his camps should be up.
something for you, man. It appears we've bit off more than we could chew. This is an overextension. Boy. They're pinging and shit. Tarek spent his time holding that wave so he can't help contest it. He can't do anything for us there. What I'm talking about here is the Tarek was holding a wave in mid because our team kind of got wiped. Because I fast forwarded, you didn't get to see. And so everybody's pinging for whatever reason. It's like, well, Tarek's doing another thing. He's he's trying to hold that wave so that you can get the farm, my guy. Something for your mind. <coughs> Dustblade Axiomark MF. Don't you mind my smoker's cough? Pack a day case the liberals away. That right there is a wombo combo. Oh my god. The Nico knockup into the Tarek, like triple stun. Tarek ult. What options did the enemy team have here? Um, fuck. This shit pisses me off so bad. Like, bro, this is the only obvious rotation. Why do you guys want to get two more kills on these two? The, the, the Alawi's like 100 gold. Or we could kill the giant worm, which gives us 1525 gold, 3800 XP, denies it from them. Come on, you idiots! Not agree with that ultimate from Tarek, but fight me. I should have used those plants. 
Uh oh, look out for that tree. Nice. Poppy going demon mode. Shit, Poppy. Poop, you pee. Karthus coming up. Do we hit the inhib first? We hit him inhib first here. Go check, yo. I sure love being a pro. Nico should have listened right there. She fucked up bad. She'd be griefing. There you go. Awesome. That's a white. It's a race. It's a race. I remember when Nice went to Korea. I forget how far he made it. We touched the uh, Masters once they switched up the ELO. Masters is super inflated right now. It's basically D2 or D3 last season. So Nice getting Masters now is fucking Good meaningless. With, uh... Same with LS. You gonna tank, dude? <sighs> Supports.
Uh-oh. Oopsie poopsie. Maybe that should have been the intro clip, huh? <laughs> Immortal Rengar, out of position? You won't believe what happens next. And there you have it. Yet another victory for our epic hero. Dicker173. Anyway, Wranglets, thank you so much for watching, everybody. And don't forget the like and sub and all that. If you're liking the editing, let me know if you think that it can improve anywhere. Also, let me know, please. Music too loud, too low, something. Any and all suggestions are welcome. But yeah, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.